Picturing God by Ruth Goring God is the Word, and that Word is love. God is the light of the world that shines in every darkness. The beautiful darkness of night, the darkness of hiding when we are afraid, the deep darkness of being all alone. God shines there. When we don't know where to go, God's light shines on our path and leads us home. God is our sunshine, and we sprout like seeds, open to the light, and start to grow. God's living water rains down from heaven to water our thirsty hearts. God's love pours over us and never stops. Living water baptizes us, saying, You belong. Jesus says, I am the vine, and you are the branches. We grow from God's vine. God's love flows through us like juicy sap. And then good things grow from us. Love and joy and peace like fat, mouth-watering grapes. God is the bread of life that feeds us and fills us up. It is God's own life given for us. The bread of life makes us strong, strong enough to share, strong enough to be kind, strong enough for pure delight. And we find new ways to give God's love away. God's goodness is like bright clothes we can put on every morning with faith as a button and peace as the sleeves. When we are in danger, Jesus is the door that opens to give us shelter and closes to keep us safe. Jesus is also the Good Shepherd who knows your name and everyone else's too. When we journey into places that are slippery and scary, our Shepherd stays close and never lets us go. Sometimes we must walk in hot dry deserts, then God is our rock, providing shade and a place to rest. God's Spirit is wind, blowing away our fear and our mean words, blowing in cheerfulness and making us new. The Spirit is our comforter, nearer than breath, teaching us what we need to know, wrapping us in love. God is a Father who forgives again and again, who watches for us and runs to meet us. God is a mother who covers us with her wings.
Jesus himself is the way we walk to God, who is our home.